I have wine. Ensorcelled by Chaos by Emperor. So this song is in standard tuning. I have tried to find some tabs on this. I've tried to search online for covers. I've tried to find the Emperor playing it live to see if I can find exactly how they're playing it. And I can't find anything. So I have figured this out all by ear. So there will be mistakes and it won't be 100%, but it will be close enough for people that want to play along to the song. Um, obviously, if anyone has got better tabs or better way of playing it I'm more than happy to have a look at those um, so put your comments in the description or links or whatever anyway let's get on with the lesson so the song starts with that riff which I've just played <laughs> so we're going to start off with those three notes which is five of the D four of the A three of the E then we're going to tremolo pick and we're playing two of the bottom string to four of the D string and then five of the D string then repeat that and then we're going to play five of the D four of the A three of the E again so slowly Last time round, instead of playing five, four, three, we're going to play five of the D, seven of the A, six of the E. So that would be. So the next riff goes a bit like this. So I'm tremolo picking two strings here. So I'm picking the A string and the D string. I'm playing a regular power chord on fret seven of the A. Then I'm bringing in the pinky onto fret 10. Then nine, 10, nine, 10 on the A string. back into this riff over the top of that we've got so we're just tremolo picking there on six of the G and then up to seven back to six and then six, uh, sorry, five, four, three on the D, A, and E. Then we have a riff that goes a bit like this. So tremolo picking on the A and the D string. So I've got nine of the A and seven of the D. Then onto the E and the A string, eight of the E, seven of the A. Move that up two frets. So 10 of the E, nine of the A. Then onto the A and D string again, seven of the A, five of the D. 7 of the A, 9 of the D, 
then we're going to play this little lick. So that's seven and five, seven and nine, seven and seven, seven and five, and that's on the A and the D. Then we're going to play three of the E, five of the A, five of the D, three of the G, five of the A and five of the D, five of the A, three of the D, three of the A, two of the D. Then regular power chords on the A string, fret two, one, three of the bottom E string, and then this little bit. So on the E string, two, three, two, and then onto the A string, two, one. So slowly. back into I hope you're enjoying this video if you are make sure you like subscribe click the little bell to allow notifications so you never miss a video and I'll see you soon nom 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 then we're back into this riff Then we have a little keyboard break, and then we have... So, open bottom string power chord, and then we're going to play open E and open B. Then we've got a three note power chord on the bottom string, so that's three, five, and five. Repeat that first bit. Then two, four, and four. Repeat the first bit. Three, five, five. Open, and then I'm gonna hit the high E string, not the B string. And then we're gonna play one, three, three, repeat. So slowly. The next riff, I couldn't really hear what was going on, but it sounded a bit like this. playing E A D string so we're going to play open bottom E 7 of the A 9 of the D then we're going to put the first finger across the bottom string as well so it'll be 7 of the E 7 of the A 9 of the D so repeat then I'm playing 8 of the E open A 10 of the D play that twice and then take that same shape down to the first fret. Repeat the first part of the riff. Then 8 open and 10 of the D. 
move it up two frets so that'll be 10 open and 12 and then up again 12 open and 14 and then back down to eight so slowly no that's completely wrong play that through a few times on the last time round we don't come back down to the 8th fret we go up to the 13th so that would be like this then we're back into this riff Let me have this riff. So this is in triplets, so we're going to play the E string once, the D string twice. And we're playing two of the E, four of the D. Then we're going to move up to three of the E five of the D, and we've also got the four of the A. So first of all, we're gonna play three of the E, five of the D, three of the E. Then we're gonna So. And then repeat that. So, slowly, the whole thing. Then we're back into this riff. This next one again was a bugger to try and figure out and I still don't think this is right but it's quite close so Gets a bit like this. So we are playing power chord on five of the A, uh, sorry, five of the E, seven of the A, seven of the D, but we've also got the open G ringing out. So we're going to play through that as if it's a chord. And then we're going to move up to the 6th fret and we're going to play from the bottom string up to the uh, D string because now we've blocked off the G, we've just got 6 of the E, 8 of the A, 8 of the D. So slowly it's... And my right hand is just going through the strings there. Over the top of that we have So tremolo picked power chords on the D string and we're going to play 7, 8, 5 8 10, 8, 10, 11. 7, 8, 5. 8, 10, 8, 10, 8. So slowly. Then 
we have. So just tremolo picked, and we're on the A string, fret three to two. On the bottom string, three to one. Then we're back into. Then we're back into Then we're back into a riff that we played earlier And then we finish on this riff So we've played this earlier, but there is a little change at the end. So instead of playing, um, a little look. so we're going to play on the bottom string two, three, two, one of uh, two of the A, then two, three, two again on the bottom string, and then we're going to play one of the A to two of the A. So slowly. 